the big debate, will cracking down on certain guns slow this epidemic of violence? Coming up to you tonight, the primitive weapons that kill even more Americans than, say, an assault rifle each year. Lawmakers are scrambling to draft legislation to ban assault rifles in the wake of the Newtown school shooting. But as reporter Joy Lipola tells us tonight, their efforts could be more about politics than making a difference. Just the term assault rifle conjures up images of large killing machines. But in America, you are more likely to be killed by a baseball bat, a knife, or even someone's bare hands in the assault rifle now being targeted by lawmakers. In the aftermath of the Newtown shooting, well, I think we can get some changes. Renewed calls to outlaw assault rifles, weapons like the AR-15 Adam Lanza used to kill 26 children and educators. Assault weapons, these are weapons of war. They belong on our battlefield, not on our street. The rhetoric from Washington implies the streets would be safe if assault rifles were banned. But what can be lost in such an emotional debate are the facts. You're not going to ban any one item, any tool, any gun, and solve the problem of school shootings, mall shootings, any of this stuff. The FBI releases annual crime statistics. Those stats show murders carried out with rifles are just a fraction of the killings in the United States. In 2011, almost 13,000 people were murdered with a weapon. 1,700 people were killed with knives. 728 were killed by another's bare hands. Hammers, bats, and clubs killed almost 500 people. And rifles, 323. Just two and a half percent of all weapon-related murders involved a rifle. For some people with law enforcement background, the facts prove the fight over assault weapons is not the answer. Think about this. If someone's willing to murder innocent children at a school, do you think they really worry about your gun laws? But the push for stricter gun control is still expected to dominate the new Congress in 2013. Hunters, people who need to protect themselves, don't need assault weapons. I think the argument has been hijacked for strict political gain uh, from folks, by the way, who have zero experience in the security field. The FBI statistics show that the murder rate has been steadily declining in almost all categories over the past five years. I'm Joy LaPola reporting. We know Facebook is wildly popular in America, but what about other countries? Turns out the social media giant is number one in 127 countries.